Hey guys, it's Justin. I just wanted to let you know that we don't have any game audio for this episode of Spongebob because a group of chimpanzees escaped from the local zoo, stole the recording computer, and made off with it. It, it was awful. Ryan lost an arm. Matt fucking died. I'm gonna try to simulate it by finding the proper background music and adding in dialogue when it's necessary, but if it sounds a little off, I just wanted you to know why. So yeah, uh, enjoy the episode. Fun, fun, fun. The pier, the pier is here. Yes, the pier is here. And the year is... Right. The month is queer. The month is... Yes, it is. It's Pride Month. Happy Pride Month to everybody. I haven't said that one yet. So, uh, if you're watching... Wait, is June Pride Month? June is Pride Month. But why? It's my birthday. I'm kidding. <laughs> I'm why? Kidding. Why would they do that on my birthday? <laughs> also, big announcement, guys. We have been accepted as one of the, the front runners in the Straight Pride Parade in Boston this year. So if you guys have any float ideas, please hit us up with that. Uh, anyway, let's see. Let's talk to Mr. Krabs. Part of the Try Hard Brigade, like Milo Yiannopoulos. Is that what they call themselves? <laughs> I wish. I had a dream last night, actually, that I was in a library and uh, Julian Assange was recording a podcast and he was like talking really loud and I'm trying to squeeze past the table and I guess I bumped his mic and he was like, what the fuck, man? And he started like getting really mad at me. Did he leak? Uh, he, well, he was leaking fluids. But he got really mad at me, and I was like, well, dude, maybe a pod, uh, like a library is not the best place to record a fucking podcast. And he's like, this is where you record podcasts. Like, the library? No. And then we got into a big fight, and I, I don't know why I had that dream, but. What are you I also had a dream do? I was in a gas station, two dudes were trying to beat the shit out of me. Yo, boys, get the Man, fuck out of here. Goddamn robots, you know? These goddamn robots. Bad robots. What's next? Marrying robots? Yeah. You know what? First, first they're gonna let men marry. Then they're gonna force us to marry robots. Okay, get rid of that no good robot. I'll give you a big reward. Okay. Big sloppy bead. Do you just have to bump his ticket booth? Doing. I think so. Oh, I, th I throw a watermelon at him. Oh, easy. Easy peasy, lemon squeezy. Aha. Take me home, play some part cheesy. <laughs> and so now, pa oh god. Oh. Fuck. Le oh, I was like, it can't be that easy. Oh, I thought you were gonna break through. No, oh, what the fuck? Patrick just killed a lot of people. Okay. Yeah, you know how much property damage that is? No. Like, he's getting arrested for this shit and sued. And he's gonna have to probably pay all that back. That's hundreds of thousands of dollars worth of damage. You can ride that shit down, I bet. Should I do it? See what's down there, you know? Well, first, let me. Boing! Uh, Yo, get on those seat. What? I <clears throat> am experiencing uh, BO right now. You are? I am. From me? No, from me. Oh. Like, I, I do not smell good. I'm oh. just sitting here. Was that it? Oh. oh, oh, oh. I saw something. Oh, because it lowers and rises. What? Oh, okay. What, uh, okay maybe, maybe not I, now. Maybe, maybe, maybe we just don't. Maybe that was just stupid. Wait, can I jump across? No. Okay. Yeah, dude. I uh, I'm gaming a little too hard over here, so I smell horrible. Are you sure? Ladies. Did you yeah. put B bo? Did you put deodorant on this <laughs> I morning? I did put bo on this morning. Yeah, that's probably why I smell bad. No, I did not put deodorant on. I took a shower. Well, that would be why. And I meant to. Well, even when I put deodorant on, I still get bo. I don't know if what mm. my if my like it, does your body can it become immune to like a certain deodorant if you use it or not? I, I've heard that. I, I never knew if it was bullshit or not. I use that Old Spice uh, Aqua Reef shit. And, uh... Oh. Well, Matt. Yeah. You wanna smell me? Ever since I stopped using deodorant. <laughs> Do I got it? Yeah. Yeah, that... See, normally... See, the thing is... Normally when I say It's not me, musky, it's sour. Yeah, dude. It's like onions. You know? Because normally when I'm like, I think I have BO, you give me a sniff and you're like, no, you're not bad. But that was one of those times you just kind of were like, ooh. Because like, there's a difference between musky and and sour, and you got a bit of the sour. Well, normally going it's on. musky, but today it's maybe it's my diet or something. What have I What have I been eating? Onions. I actually I did have some onions. Yes. Uh, this morning. No, I went. I got Korean barbecue that night, and like one of the dishes was like straight onions. God, I wish I was you. I could just gorge and gorge and gorge on whatever I wanted. I love eating, dude. I I love it too, but like I got I have this weird anxiety with eating, where like sometimes when I start eating, like I don't think it's an eating disorder, definitely not. But like when I start eating, sometimes I just get like anxious, and then I just lose my appetite. And if I keep eating, I'll get really nauseous. You get anxious from eating. 
Yeah, I don't know why. Like, not not from the act of eating itself, but I get anxious while I'm eating. And uh, then I just lose my appetite. And if I keep e forcing myself to eat, I'll, like, be on the verge of vomiting. And it happens to my mom, too. So I don't know if it's, like, a genetic thing. I talked to my doctor about it, and he said it's just, like, an anxiety. Try telling a kid in Africa that, Matt. I know. I know. Like, when I eat, I just get too anxious. I get too nervous they'll when look, I'm eating. They'll look at you just like, what the fuck are you talking about? I'll eat then. I'll eat your food. I can't. Kind man. Well, you do eat my food a lot of times at restaurants. I won't finish it. No, that's Harrison. Harrison, like, I was about I to finish. say, is like, no, I don't. Harrison will just fucking, like, destroy my plate. I'll be like, dude, have the rest. I like having friends that can finish my plate for me. Because like, usually when I go to a restaurant, I don't usually finish my plate. I usually have, like, a little bit left. Uh, just, I'm just, like, I don't have a big appetite naturally. Like, I can honestly go a day without Do you eating. Do you think that's why you're so skinny? Because you just don't eat? Yeah. Well, I, I think, like, I think I just have a really high metabolism. And, uh... Well, if you're not eating anything, I mean, to maintain... Honestly, like, to maintain a good weight for your height, I'm estimating you'd probably have to eat... Like, 3,000 calories a, a day, right? Anywhere between 2,600 to 3,000. Which, right, honestly... There's honestly, let's just say 2,600. Legit, there's days where I, I... And I know it's super unhealthy. There's days where I probably only have 400 calories. What do you eat? Nothing sometimes. I know you eat sugary snacks. No, I, I cut back on those, mainly. Like, I don't eat that much candy anymore. <laughs> yeah, I'm I gonna, just, like, I I'm don't gonna know. cut back on eating entirely. Well, no, it's not that I'm cutting back. I just legit, uh, just don't get hungry. I don't know why. And I can go, I can wake up and go a whole day without eating. And then I feel like... I really, like, I can't stop picturing myself, like, bringing, like, a projector screen, putting up a big sound system, and playing this exact, like... like a school in Africa? Yeah, yeah, yeah. I would feel horrible. What is this man's problem? They'd go, I don't know. He's fucking stupid. <laughs> You put the food in your mouth. It is crazy how much we do it. under like uh, appreciate the legit value of food because because we have such easy access to it in America, and how it's like. See, that, that's that, the problem. That's why you don't enjoy food. It's too easy to get, Matt. I you, you live for the chase. <laughs> yeah, I live for the chase. I, I need to I need to move out somewhere in like the middle of like Nevada where there's no restaurants or anything, and I have to grow my own food. SpongeBob needs the bubble bowl. Oh, okay. I need a power I don't have yet. So go, back to Patrick? yeah, go to Patrick and then throw that fucking watermelon and then launch yourself, I, I guess. Oh, you know I'm about to do that. Dude, look at how cute he is. He's cute, dude. God, he's cute. Can't get over how fucking adorable Patrick is. Patrick's a cute motherfucker. You see a man looking like Patrick walking into your house, uninvited, at 2 a.m., I'd let him smash. I'd let him climb in my bed and tickle <laughs> my prostate. I'd let him read my kids a bedtime story as I'm sleeping. And then let him tickle my prostate afterwards. He can tickle my kids for all I care. Not in a sexual way. Of course not in a sexual way. Those are my kids. Of course. Of course I'd let my kids sleep with Michael Jackson. It's Michael Jackson! <laughs> okay, so I can also open up this clam Ooh, for... 20... Tw ooh, oh, yes. I got like yes, 10,000 fucking objects. What do we get? Objects. Oh. I get to ride some underwater bungee. I think I gotta be Spongebob for this though, oh, right? Oh, I don't know what, what the, fuck? the fuck you're showing us, but... Oh, there's a... So I gotta get up there. To get to the hook. Maybe... Uh, I wonder if Patrick can do the bungee. Let's see. Boing. Alright. Let's see if Patrick's cute ass can do the bungee. Okay. Do I need to, like, press something to latch onto this or just jump into it? Okay. Well, well that clearly was not the answer. <laughs> I swear to God. Do you need SpongeBob to latch on to that shit? Well, let me press a button. Like, press a button. It would give you a prompt if you had I'm to press a circle. button. Like with, like oh. with Sandy, or with whatever. Get SpongeBob back and do all that shit over again. Yeah, because I can easily jump. You're getting up there tired of watching this pink motherfucker fuck around and not do anything that's that's I'm gonna make the level go boy. forward. Use the R1 button. Okay, I, I done did use it. I'm gonna go on back this way. Shit, okay. You know, I caught I caught a few white tails in my, in my backyard the other night. Rabbits? It's fucking deer, you jackass. Oh, white, sorry. Dude, I saw a big-ass coyote walking down the street the other night. Did you say hi? I did, actually. He's just trotting down the street, and I rolled out my window, and I looked at him, and I, and I was like... And he just glanced at me and just kept trotting on by. Could not have cared less. All right, cool. Nice going, SpongeBob. <laughs> you fucking SpongeBob. Okay. 
Will that do anything? There we go. So I do have to be SpongeBob. Ooh. Okay. Ready? There. Yeah, I got myself a goddamn spatula. Can I, I hit these things? I don't know. No, okay. So, so you're done. You can't hit him. I'll just hit him, get some coinage. I love his cries of joy. It's, I like his little butt cheeks, too. SpongeBob got some fucking cake. You ever had a wedgie that made you cry? From pleasure? Mm, no, from pain. No. Uh, well, if you get a hard enough wedgie, like, that shit will actually, like, cut your asshole. That computer keeps doing some stupid bullshit. It does. Bullshit. The recording computer keeps popping some windows up, and it's making me nervous. There's a slide that you can do Yo. shit on, but I don't know how you, you see Yo. that's the end of it right there. Where's the beginning? Where's the be- Right there, yeah! To the right, to the right. Oh, that is the be- yes, that's the end. Oh, now what do we have here? Tongue time. Tongue time, baby. Oh, dude, these are like my favorite parts of the game. Like anything you can ride, like in Donkey Kong Country, the minecart Oh, okay, I don't want to hit those, yep. Got it. <laughs> I didn't realize those were the red ones. Oops. Yikes. Yeah, I goof myself. Man. Now to try again. Yeah, you know, I really like how the Santa Monica Pier, how there's that like little like thing in the middle of the pier, but it's like, you can see the ocean through this hole. And you look down, it's just this nasty, grimy fucking <laughs> like, smells like fish, like hole with just some dark water below. Have some dead baby seals in there. I wouldn't be surprised. Do you, you're not supposed to swim in Santa Monica. Like there's signs that are like, don't touch the water here. Wait, really? Yeah. Okay, but if you wait, go- Wait, it's Santa Monica Beach? Yes. People, you, people swim all the time. I know, but if you go to the left of the pier, uh, you know where like, the little- There's a part where like a river drains into, um, the ocean? Mm-hmm. Like a, one of those concrete LA rivers? And what am I supposed to be doing? I feel like you've made it to the- Can I see the- I just want to yeah, walk yeah, around yeah. and see what's um, going on. And there's a big sign that says, like, coming in contact with the water can be, like, harmful to your health. There's chemicals, shit like that. Because the L.A. River might be one of the grossest fucking human creations on Earth. High levels of feces. There's human remains in there. And I see people fishing in that shit, and I'm only- I'm praying that they don't eat it. That they're not, like, getting dinner. Because there's a lot of, uh, mutations and shit. Like, they've caught a lot of fish and, and things that have mutations. I think you need Patrick to yeah. throw the- Watermelon. Ooh! Oh, is he yeah. gonna take this to the island? Hell yeah. Now, here we go, baby. Except, we have not lit the tower yet, have we? But, we did a Spongebob. We, we haven't lit the tower on the island. Yeah, that's why we came all the way over here, right? Oh, no, we have lit the tower. Yeah. Oh! You jackass, Forget, forgetting what I've done for this channel. Everything I've done. No, I-, I Working my ass off! No, I appreciate it all, every little bit of it. I really do. <laughs> I'm sorry. Here we go. Yo, fuck that robot. Right? Fuck that robot. We just got everybody's sunscreen back, didn't we? Did we? That's- the robot had all the sunscreen. Ooh. Larry and was now, getting burnt. Now we use this. To get your sweet sponge ass over there, Ryan. The fuck? Oh, now we gotta talk to Mr. Man. <laughs> Woo! We got another golden spatula, I bet baby. you now we can at least go to another area. Oh, oh yeah, absolutely. Oh, uh, 19. I bet you we need 20. You're though. a fucking boss rusher. You might be able to do that Sandy boss. The thing is, I just got in there and I didn't know what to do, and I was like, do I really want to fuck around with this for a while and figure out? I mean, we could go try to beat that Sandy boss. I do remember beating her Let's as go a kid. see. Let's go see. Do I just go back this way? Yeah. So, uh... Cool. I have brought you to here to face a great challenge. Yes. I've got nerves of steel and muscles of sand. Okay. And eyes of jelly. My Poseidon has been complete. <laughs> By a mighty foe whom you must vanquish. Yes. Okay. Bring it on, your highness. Bring it Is it? On. Could it be? We already saw this, didn't we? Could it be Sandy Cheeks? Yeah, I was just saying if there if we missed. Can I just hit her with my? No. Hit her with the Quan, bro. Oh, all right. <laughs> I do okay, like that. Is there something I need to do though? Um, let's see. Right there, right there. Can you? Oh yeah, oh you gotta you gotta do the fucking uh yeah. What? I think you have to ground pound it. Man, jump and see what happens, you fucking bitch. Oof! Okay, that's actually- I need to not be- Oh, go get it. You got time. 
Yo, Sandy just got her cheeks handed to her. Uh-oh, phase two, baby. This is phase two. If you can beat every Sekiro boss many times, if you can beat every Cuphead boss many times, you got this fucking Sandy Hooks bitch. <laughs> did I say Sandy Hooks? Sandy Hooks. Jesus, I meant Jesus to say Sandy Hooks. fucking cheeks. Christ. What the fuck did that come That's a from? Very big difference. Very big difference. My, that was a Freudian slip right there. Why were you thinking of Sandy I Hook? I wasn't thinking of Sandy Hook. It's just Sandy Cheek, Sandy Hook. It's kind of a similar sound. Yo, dude, give Sandy some pipe. Ha <laughs> ha! Give me that head. I'm gonna throw you in the electrical shit. Even though there is a button on you. Looks like Patrick's getting head! Ooh. Ooh. Shit! Oh, dope, dude. Do it again, do it again, Yo, Biatch. Neptune's got that kind of like real sassy flamboyant hip hold going on with his hands. You see that? Hold on. Where I need he's behind like me. Like a right sassy barber. Oh there no, he's he not doing it anymore. Alright. Watch out for that shockwave. Drop it like it's hot. Give me Pick that fucking that head. Ooh, 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 ready for this? Yeah. Ha ha! And boom. here comes the boom. Ready or not. How you like me now? So that's Robo Sandy. They definitely have a Robo Squidward because that's what they said in the in the remaster. I think that's that Robo Squidward was, was left out. Yeah. So they're gonna put that in the new one. I'm excited for all the deleted shit they're gonna put back in. Oh, <gasps> she's saying, "Gimme, give gimme." Give Hiya. Nice. Back as SpongeBob now. Damn, SpongeBob. Oh, he's scared. I can't wait to see these cutscenes actually look good. What do you mean? Nothing. Like that. Okay. So. Let's let's see what she's doing this time. She's doing karate chop. She's, she's gonna, gonna, she's she's gonna, gonna do that thing again. Oh, Ooh, I see what she's doing. okay. Oh, she got a fucking clothesline. Now she's gonna now I'm guessing she's just gonna jump. Oh, you got this. You got this in the bag. What? Oh, hit oh. the button, hit the button, hit the button. Triangle. Oh, oh. Ooh, you gotta time it. Nice. Okay, like an uppercut. That's pretty easy. We got this. I probably could have done this earlier. Yeah, that's what I'm saying. You could have. I'm just in. You didn't believe in yourself. I mean, when I when I fought that boss in in Sekiro, that was pretty fucking tough. Not the Mr. Noble, the one you had me get ambushed by. Oh, whoops. The fucking headless horseman. Oh yeah. So I'm very intimidated by game bosses. Bosses are not my strong. Actually, video games just aren't my strong suite. So. Strong suit? Is it strong suit? Yeah. Is it really? Yes. I've been saying it wrong my whole fucking life. Wait, really? Yeah, I've been saying strong suit. Oh, I've been saying that to like people. People? Yeah. Like who? Just like people I'd be. It's my strong suit. <laughs> they probably just thought it was like a little whoops of the tongue. <sighs> it's my strong suit. I just feel like a jackass now. <laughs> I mean, you know, they have the, can I get a sweet? It's spelled like suit, except with an E. Why does it gotta be spelled the same? <laughs> I don't think it is. Look at strong that. Strong sweet? Sweet and suit. Like my, it's spelled my, suit, my S-U-I-T, right? My strong suit right? my is strong spelled suit. like sweet, right? Is, no, I don't think so. Well, that might be where, why I got it wrong all this time, because I thought it was spelled that way. I, I promised myself I wouldn't cry. So now we have 20 golden spatulae. Yeah, dude, that means we can definitely unlock a new place. <laughs> In the next episode. Bye!